Today's medical centric topic is how artificial sweeteners affect your gut and brain. The sweet deception. They promise zero calories, zero sugar, and zero guilt. But do artificial sweeteners really come with zero consequences? Found in diet sodas, protein bars, and sugar free foods, these sweeteners, like aspartame, sucralose, and stevia, are everywhere. While they may help you reduce sugar intake, new research shows they might confuse your gut and brain in ways we're only beginning to understand. How they work. Artificial sweeteners are hundreds of times sweeter than sugar, but your body doesn't metabolize them the same way. That's how they provide sweetness without calories. However, the human body evolved to associate sweetness with energy, calories. When that link is broken, your brain and gut get mixed signals. Impact on your gut microbiome. Your gut isn't just a digestion machine. It's home to trillions of bacteria. Several studies have shown that artificial sweeteners can alter gut bacteria composition, especially sucralose and saccharin. These changes may reduce beneficial bacteria, increase gut permeability, leaky gut, affect how your body regulates blood sugar. In fact, a 2022 study in Cell found that even small amounts of some sweeteners changed the gut microbiome and altered glucose control in healthy adults within just two weeks. Brain and Metabolic Confusion When your tongue tastes sweet, your brain expects energy to follow. But when no calories arrive, it creates reward pathway confusion. Over time, this can increase sugar cravings, dull your brain's response to sweetness so you crave even more, disrupt hunger-regulating hormones like ghrelin and leptin. Some people even experience increased appetite and weight gain despite using zero-calorie products. Aspartame, one of the most common sweeteners, has also been studied for potential effects on mood and headaches, though findings are mixed. Are natural sweeteners any better? Stevia and monk fruit are often marketed as natural, but that doesn't automatically mean they're harmless. While they seem to have less impact on the microbiome, more long-term research is still needed. Smart Sweet Choices Use artificial sweeteners sparingly, not daily. Focus on retraining your taste buds by reducing overall sweetness in your diet. Choose whole foods, fruits, yogurt, dark chocolate for a touch of natural sweetness. If you're using them for diabetes management, talk to your doctor about the safest options. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.